Invite a budget blind style consultant to show you how to transform your rooms just by changing your window coverings. Canada's number one choice for window coverings. Visit budgetblinds.ca today. Downtown Lloydminster has a new tenant, a retail store that uses their profits to help out others. Second Chance is run by Labus, the Lloydminster and Area Brain Injury Society. Money earned from the used clothing store funds their life enrichment program, which gives people a chance to socialize and develop life skills. Um, so we use it all for our program, and it's for our local brain injured clients. Um, they come in, it offers 18 hours of free respite care for the caregivers, which is a huge benefit to everybody. The store's profits help Labus reduce their dependence on grants and fundraising. Second Chance moved from their old location last Thursday. Uh, the rent had been increasing, so it was just no longer functional for us to operate out of there and we were hoping now that we're downtown with the foot traffic it'll be easier for people to just stop in and our volunteers to come and have a help us out and people just to have a look around. The store relies solely on donations from the public. Labus' other fundraising venture, a used bookstore currently inside their office space, will be moving into second chance by the end of the summer. If it feels wrong, ask. That's the concept behind two award-winning safety videos made by students at Lloyd Comp High School. The filmmakers entered their productions in the Work Safe Saskatchewan Youth Video Contest and came away as winners. Tori Bainton and her partners made her partner made this video about being distracted at work. They were awarded second place out of 28 entries, winning $700 for themselves and $1,000 for their school. Oh, it's really cool <laughs> um, to be able to for everyone to see it and just to be able to, um, I guess, acknowledge what you've put your time and effort into is really cool. I should have asked him. Another group from the comp won third place for their dramatic portrayal of a father losing his sight because of improper workplace safety. The students made the videos as part of a communications media course. Like I think it's um, a great opportunity to learn different skills and I think that if it's definitely something that you want to go into further in life, this is a great class just to um, figure that out. Their work was on display today as part of the Lloyd Comp Film Festival. If you'd like to check out the videos for yourself, you can go to worksafesask.ca. It's time once again to showcase two more animals up for adoption in this week's pet project. Katori is a four-month-old shepherd cross, and Ursula is a one-year-old long-haired domestic hat. Here's Anne-Marie from the SPCA. It's okay. Are you scared of the camera? Meet Katori, a fun four-month-old shepherd cross. She has been spayed, dewormed, and received her first set of vaccinations, but will need a rabies vaccine after adoption. Katori is a big bundle of energy and loves to play, learn new games, and explore new places. For a puppy, she's really good at focusing and even knows how to sit. With the regular training routine, some practice, and a little patience, She'll be awesome at it in no time. She's also super friendly and loves getting attention. Katori came to us as a stray and was treated for a sarcoptic mange, but has been cleared and is ready to go. If you come meet her today, she's sure to give you lots of puppy kisses to say hello. Come check her out today. Say hello to Ursula, a one-year-old domestic long hair. She has been spayed, dewormed, and received her first set of vaccinations but will require a rabies vaccine after adoption. In addition to being extremely cute and sweet, Ursula is as friendly as can be and loves to be cuddled. She's also a pretty curious little kitty. She's comfortable being independent and can keep herself busy, and she doesn't cry if much for attention. But don't let that fool you. New friends are her favorite. Ear scratches and belly rubs are some of her favorite things to receive. If you think that she's your kind of gal, then come meet her today.